In today's large-scale cloud environment, an IT admin's day is filled with complex tasks of configuring and managing compute network storage workloads, which can quickly become overwhelming. That's why Nutanix has introduced the self-service custom pass provider in PC 2024.3, giving you the power to automate provisioning and managing any workloads seamlessly across any cloud platform. Hello, I'm Lakshna Rajendran, Technical Marketing Engineer at Nutanix. In the upcoming video series, I'll guide you through how this new feature can streamline your cloud management and enhance efficiency. Let's dive in. In self-service, accounts are cloud credentials that can be used for deploying, monitoring and managing applications. When using self-service to deploy resources to a specified cloud account, these resources were typically limited to compute resources. For example, Nutanix VMs or AWS EC2 instances. True scalability requires automation across all resources including storage and network resources to enable a more flexible and comprehensive cloud experience. NCM self-service introduces the provider entity enabling admins to define resources beyond native compute resources and use them in later workflows to manage any resource across the supported cloud platform offering a scalable solution that adapts to evolving resource needs. Before we dive in, let's level set on some of the concepts. Accounts refer to cloud credentials that allow for deploying, monitoring and managing applications within the platform. Projects organizes users or groups typically from Active Directory around a shared purpose or function. Projects define member roles, designate specific networks for VM deployments and can set limits or infrastructure resource usage, helping teams manage resources effectively. Runbooks are frameworks that automate routine tasks and procedures. Tasks within the platform can include various automated actions such as executing shell or python e-scripts, making REST API calls specific to HTTP endpoints or performing database operations. With the new provider framework, we have introduced a resource type operation expanding capabilities for task automation and customization. To take an example use case, Let's think about an IT admin who wants to create a runbook that includes a task for the creation of an AWS S3 bucket. Previously, the developer would have to code this task using HTTP APIs or eScripts to create an S3 bucket. With the self-service custom provider feature, an admin can now create a custom provider based on AWS and define a resource type and action to create the bucket along with any required inputs. Once created, this action is now predefined and reusable across runbooks. Now when creating runbooks, the developer only has to select the resource action and provide the input variables to customize it for their needs and the complexities of the operation are abstracted away. The custom provider feature is accessible in the self-service dashboard within Prism. Use the application switcher to navigate to the self-service dashboard. Let's select providers. Let's go ahead and click on the system configure Nutanix pass provider. As you can see, the Nutanix pass provider offers 8 available resources including buckets, object store, VMs, security policies and subnets that can be orchestrated. A system configure Nutanix pass provider cannot be edited and its configuration file cannot be downloaded. However, you can clone the system configured provider and make any necessary changes to the cloned version. The create button enables you to configure a custom provider from scratch. You will need to enter in details such as the provider name, the cloud account type, it can be Nutanix, GCP, AWS, Azure and VMware and the account schema configuration. The account schema configuration includes authentication details and server endpoint information required to log into the cloud account. Provider verification will test authentication with the provider using a test account. This test account will also be utilized to validate provider actions. Custom providers can be shared with others by downloading them as JSON files. The downloaded custom providers can then be imported using the upload option. The test action logs offers details on the status of actions executed for the resource type specified in the custom providers. Nutanix self-service custom provider simplifies automating all available resources across any cloud account within a unified control plane. In our upcoming videos, we'll explore real-world scenarios for configuring and testing these custom providers. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.